Okay, introducing the new Cyvex Yaris plug and play engine management system from Cyvex. Uh, you can see it in my hands here. It is a direct replacement for the factory unit. We'll show you some pictures of it actually being installed and actually so you can see the unit in place. It utilizes the factory mounting brackets to allow it to mount into the original location and works with the full selection of sensors that are available on the OEM car, including the Lambda sensor. There is an additional 26-way connector at the back. This is for connecting the Ethernet to. Also connecting in additional sensors for Lambda, uh, inputs, outputs, whatever you like. And there's two additional CAN buses on there for aftermarket dashes, data loggers, etc. The unit adds a lot of in, uh, such cool features on the car. Um, the main things that are, uh, the end user is probably going to like to see is the ability to now have obviously anti-lag, uh, adjustable traction control, and that will feed into a much more advanced ECU that allows much more control over the engine. Uh, there's a lot of safety features implemented on it. We've got the oil pressure, oil temperature, lean lambda, fuel pressure trip. So you're not only buying an ECU that is adding more control, it's also protecting your investment in the car as well and the engine. Some of the nice features that warn the drivers as well is we've got the dash beeping. So in the event of knock or warning, the dash will actually beep to let you know that there is actually an issue with the car. And if it gets to a certain level of, um, of problems, then it will bring the engine management light on. But we found that a simple buzzer would be a nice touch just to give you kind of a heads up that something's not right before you suddenly get all guns blazing with the, the dash lights, etc. This car's also got our four wheel drive controller, which will be shown in the video as well. That is additionally a plug-in unit which goes straight into the factory location, giving you full control of the all-wheel drive on the car. When the car is in two-wheel drive, it literally has no traction at all. So the four-wheel drive system on the car is a huge advantage. And being able to now give more power to the rear, adjust it in your corners, trim it live with a trim pot and even via the sport mode, etc. It really makes it a unique package for the car. Another useful feature also worth mentioning is that the dash displays the calibration switch position you're currently in. So when you change map using the cruise levers, you can actually see which map you're currently in. And the speed limit at the top will actually show you your fuel content, the ethanol content as well, when changing calibration. So if you are running a flex fuel setup, you're aware of the ethanol content you are currently running.